We got a gameplay here on the new takeover ward, Pink Diamond, Brook Lopez, and NBA 2K23. My team, he's going to be the second takeover card from Season 2. He's going to be a 95 overall, and he can play that center position. Being 7 foot is obviously going to be a pretty good height for that center spot. You know, it could be a little bit taller, but definitely not going to be short for center. He's also got a good player model, weighing in at 270 pounds. Looking at his stats, he's got a 94 three ball with an 89 mid-range. So obviously going to be a great stretch big. If you guys have been playing my team for a couple years, or at least for a while, you guys will know Brook Lopez, always a really good stretch in my team he's going to be a decent finisher around the rim having an 80 standing dunk and a 75 driving dunk defensively he's going to be great on the interior and overall is actually going to be a very very good defender 94 block 96 interior defense with also having a 78 steal and an 80 perimeter so i mean for your center he's able to play some really really elite defense he's going to be a great rebounder as well with 92 offensive and 92 defensive you could say the cards maybe a little bit too slow only having 70 speed and 70 acceleration with a 59 speed with ball and then taking a look at his badges here he does does have seven on hall of fame including masher catch and shoot claymore corner specialist anchor post lockdown and brick walls i mean some pretty good hall of fame badges there obviously catch and shoot masher claymore those are going to be some really elite badges and then he does have 19 on gold and two on silver and one on bronze i mean overall looks to be actually a very solid center i do want to give a massive shout out to crabs for letting me use his account for today's gameplay you guys might know crabs he did qualify in the second 250k qualifiers so he's an absolute w for letting me use his account for today's gameplay but yeah we're gonna hop into freestyle here test out Brooke Lopez's, uh, Brooke Lopez's jump shot and kind of see what he does on the courts. I mean, jump shot wise. Okay. What the hell is that? Okay. That release, I'm not going to lie, is a little bit questionable. That might be the weirdest first jump shot I've ever taken. So it's going to be slow. If you guys haven't uh, checked out 2KDB yet, this jump shot's actually on slow timing. So if you're going to get this card or if you have him, you got to know that this release is definitely going to be slow. But once you get it down, it doesn't seem to be the worst release in the game, but I definitely wouldn't, you know, recommend using him for his release. Like I wouldn't say like he's got a great jump shot that you want to have on your center, but I do feel like if you get it down, you, you spend some time in freestyle. I feel like it's not going to be that bad of a release but i need to get it down because even though i'm greening some shots here i have no idea when i'm supposed to release this so yeah i will say jump shot gonna be very solid does he have the normal leaner or am i tripping there's no way they gave him the normal leaner right okay yeah so he doesn't have the normal leaner and then on the inside i mean he's gonna be you know pretty tall seven foot and he's got some good standing dunk animation so overall i think he's gonna be a really good stretch big very similar to a guy like porzingis let's go green one more three and let's get on to the pink diamond brooke lopez gameplay into the clutch time online game here with the pink diamond brooke lopez looking to start on the offensive possession can we knock down that three and yes we do with pink diamond brooke lopez man starting off the game hot with our first three ball on the game my opponent does have a very good squad he's got guys like lamello ball kareem at the center position he's got ricky davis so it should be a really good test for a guy like brooke lopez to see what he can do against in my opinion the best center in the game being cream but good defense here from the squad can we grab that rebound yes we do it with brooke lopez and we are running in transition i think this card's going to be super elite in that pick and pop right setting the screen and then pop into the the three point line i think that's where he's going to be the most effective as look at brooke lopez he's going back to back from the three-point line giving us giving himself six points and one rebound on the gameplay so far so i mean this card starting off pretty hot gotta watch that pass in the corner we are there good defense here from brooke lopez gotta watch that pass inside can we play some good d probably a bad jump and oh my lord that kareem card just absolutely baptized tim thomas or ricky davis i should say he just baptized ricky davis man but looking to go around that screen from brooke lopez my opponent probably knows we're gonna pop so we're gonna find him on the inside and he's gonna get that dunk to go over danny green i mean so far this card started out super hot at least on the offensive end i do want to see what he, i do want to see what he can do on the defensive side of things right see what he can do matching him against a guy like cream but so far i mean good defense man gotta watch that shot from obi Toppin. he's gonna find danny green on the inside is he able to get that off we're gonna force him a bad shot we can't grab that rebound gotta get back out to cream we are here good defense from brooke gotta watch him going up and danny green he is gonna get that standing dunk to go good take from my opponent but man we got to cook on the offensive end here brooke lopez already started off super hot looking to go around that screen can we create some space on the inside brooke lopez taking cream on the inside and he's going crazy man 10 points one rebound but guys let me know in the comment section down below what do you guys think about this pink, uh, pink diamond brooke lopez card do you guys think he's going to be you know a top five center top 10 where do you guys do think he's going to rank amongst the best centers in the game i think for me personally i would say he's probably going to be number six or number seven my top five consists of something like kareem uh tim Duncan in chris stops probably at four and five i go like hakeem and dwight and then maybe adf uh, ad at six so something like that for my top five or six centers so i think brooke lopez could definitely be somewhere around that seven you know six to seven range but man 
this card's jump shot i know it's i know i was saying in freestyle it definitely wasn't the best release but once you get used to this card's jump shot it's actually pretty money and i feel like you can knock down very very consistently but good defense here from brooke lopez gotta watch that pass inside trying to go up against a guy like cream can we get that paint stop we are here look at brooke lopez playing some amazing defense and we're gonna grab that rebound and we are running in transition can we continue the great play here looking to go around that screen no way we get our three right okay yeah now he's guarding the pick and pop man we're gonna take him off the dribble though look at brooke lopez going all the way he's using that gold bully badge pussing up uh pushing lamella ball i should say out the way as we're gonna get that tip pass can we grab the ball trey young diving out of bounds i also forgot to mention we got opal trey young so we got to use him a little bit more obviously not gonna be shooting too many threes with trey young if you guys want to go check out my gameplay with him you guys obviously definitely can where i did a gameplay you know actually using the card but, i mean so far he's got five assists which is definitely not the uh, definitely not the worst good defense here from brooke lopez he honestly has cream in a box right now i'm not gonna lie to you guys he is dog and cream can we grab the rebound yes we do with Giannis, and we are running in transition let's try to find brooke lopez here can we find him at that four point line no way brooke lopez and damn we just airballed that we gotta hustle back on defense we absolutely just airballed that three gotta get back on defense gotta watch that pass in the corner we are here brooke lopez trying to play some good defense look at the help oh yeah we are here bam we are playing some amazing defense we're gonna get that great contest on danny green can we grab the boards yes we do and we are running in transition trying to find brooke lopez trying to get that four point opportunity once again okay so i don't think this card's got that four point range in him i'm sure you can knock down fours obviously you know, obviously he can shoot four pointers, but I would say three point range is probably where you want to stay with this card, where he's going to be the best as we try to get that steal with Ricky Davis. Yes, we do. And my opponent is out of here, man. We just absolutely dominated him with Brooke Lopez. So yeah, guys, that's going to do it for the pink diamond Brooke Lopez gameplay. Let me know in the comment section down below. What do you guys think about this card? And let me know, are you guys going to be grinding for him or do you guys already have him? Let me know down below and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.